In today's release of the AngularJS plugin, I added a couple new features. The first one being if you type two curly braces, it'll automatically insert two more just to save you a couple of keystrokes there. Uh, also, if you add a custom element, um, now the autocomplete for the Angular directives will work. That didn't work before. Um, also, if you alt enter on one of these, uh, on one of the Angular directives, you can see open Angular docs. So I'll just hit enter there and that'll launch the Angular docs pointing to that directive. And uh, last but not least, there's a go to Angular command now. So if you go into the preferences and go into the key map and you search for go to Angular, you'll see that uh, go to Angular is bound. I bound it to command L. Uh, by default, that actually is bound to uh, navigate to line um, right here. So just right click and say remove keyboard shortcut or go to uh, go to Angular and change the keyboard shortcut if you want. I just never use go to line, so I just uh, do go to Angular there. Um, so once I hit command L, you can see a list of the Angular filters, modules, controllers, etc., cetera. Um, and you can just hop around your Angular app. Just to note, this only works in uh, WebStorm 7, and I'm gonna be supporting WebStorm 7 and beyond from here on out with this. Um, you can find the EAP, the Early Access Program, just search for WebStorm EAP, um, and you can download it. Um, this can, you can also filter by module, I'll show you all the modules, or by the names, uh, so if I type phone um, or foo control, I can navigate. Uh, so if I'm in, like in my app and I type foo control, I can jump straight over to my HTML where that ng controller is defined. Um, last, just kind of a note for some people, you may notice that this is highlighted in that tannish color. So if you hit Alt Enter, it'll say, this is a custom HTML attribute, and that's why it's highlighted. Uh, it's just not supported uh, as an HTML attribute since it's a custom one. If you hit to the right and go over to Disable Inspection, uh, that'll turn that off. Some people have asked me how you do that. It's just a tangent I'm throwing in at the end of this video. Um, has nothing to do with Angular plugin. Uh, but yeah, anyway, just recap the braces, the... Uh, custom elements with uh, Angular Directive Autocomplete, the uh, Angular docs, and then the uh, go to Angular stuff. Uh, again, go to Angular only works in WebStorm 7, and uh, enjoy, file bugs, and have fun.